And we are just about set to go for first kick. Referee today, Mark Allerton, his ninth USL championship appointment this year. We are underway from Widener Field in Colorado Springs. Switchbacks in black, San Antonio in all white. Eerie moment on the back line. And here they go again. Nathan in on goal. Nathan scores. Mackengila has to be better. Gets the pocket picked, and then you can't lose your. And here goes Nishi Galina. Galina cuts back. Galina save. Haji Berry's there. And of course, he scores. Up to Shane Beckard. Doesn't matter. The numbers of black jerseys in front of the goal. A massive con for concern in San Antonio FC. Which is the play now for Gallegos, who cuts in field. Gallegos blocked down, appeal for handball, penalty! Edwards got in the way. The referee spotted it, a yellow card issued, and San Antonio a chance to take the lead right back. In step, head down, power, top bins the entire way. One more look at it. It'll be PC who scores! The first penalty kick goal on the season for San Antonio. They reclaim the lead on the road. On the training ground and try and replicate over and over and over. I'm just talking about in terms of results. Yep. That team can play, we know that. Gallegos keeps this moving. Melvin off his line. And it's another penalty. And it looks like Mayaka ran right into the referee. A yellow card issued. And now Nathan steps to the spot. And Nathan puts it away, goes left again. Timing is everything, and it's of the essence for Nathan just before halftime. Oh, no. For the switch of play, and look at all the space. Marcus Epps, it's two on one. Epps off the post. Gallegos to the near side, Epps to the far touchline. What a ball by Cam Lindley. Even better first touch, to be fair, by Epps. A little bit surprised he doesn't go around the goalkeeper. Watch all the pace coming forward. Little touch around him. You've got him right where you want him if you're Marcus Epps. Can't fault him, though. He does have the angle. Woodwork. It's actually the first professional base out of Hawaii to sign with the Sounders. And he, he signed with what was then known as Seattle Sounders 2, now Tacoma Defiance. Played in behind, great chance to pull one back, and there it is for the switchbacks. It's Zach Sandy, the second half substitute. It's his first goal on the season, it's 3-2, and here we go for the final 17 minutes. And there's the final whistle. Three goals, three points, and more importantly, San Antonio FC snaps its seven-game winless streak.